What's going on everyone? It's Marcellus back with another video. Today we're going to be going over Baby Doge, talking about how Binance actually may be teasing the listing of Baby Doge. So we're going to go over that and we're also going to go over some technicals today. So definitely hit that like button and subscribe. It really helps the YouTube channel out immensely for the YouTube algorithm. Leave a comment in the comment section and let me know what you all want me to go over next. Also, if you want these automated trading indicators, definitely check out the Vital Algo link in the description and use the discount code Marcellus for 25% off. If you want 10% off all your trading fees, definitely check out the MEXC Global link in the description. And remember, I'm not a financial advisor and none of this is financial advice, but let's get straight to Baby Doge. So the first thing that we're going to be talking about here with Baby Doge is the tease that we have literally from Binance. So Binance literally just now made a whole thing on their website, a whole post on their official Binance website. And it's a how to buy Baby Doge post. This is official. So the fact that they're publishing an article on their website about how to buy Baby Doge, this could show that Binance is really looking towards holding Baby Doge or buying Baby Doge. And another thing about this is maybe Binance is doing this just to kind of gauge how strong the community is, how many different views they get on this particular page, just to see, you know, just to see the community and if they want to list by baby doge or not so this could be a possible test here for binance to list baby doge they're just kind of seeing how everything is with baby doge army so this is huge potential right here we have huge potential with baby doge and binance here so hopefully we can get listed onto there now as you can see binance is all our baby doge is also trending literally the number two most trended project on the binance smart chain for twitter the first one being pancake swap and that's for obvious reasons because pancake swap you got to use that for transferring any binance coin or you know pretty much sending any binance coin anywhere and then on top of that we got this other thing here for baby doge so by baby doge being the top project with the highest bulls sentiment right under pancake swap so pancake swap has really been taken over but we have the highest bullish sentiment right under pancake swap so we're right at number two with that so that's also very good and i'm really just excited for the whole tease with baby doge on binance because this just kind of shows that eventually like surely slowly but surely we're eventually gonna end up getting on binance we don't know how we don't know when but slowly but surely we should be getting over there on binance now moving on from this we gotta go talk about this with robin hood just now said so they said we listed sheep what will you comment now so this was from yesterday now, this is another thing that they're doing. So maybe Robinhood could be teasing a baby doge listing. But it says somehow we ended up here with crypto and dog reads on the side. And then the the middle of it being pretty much Robinhood listing the cryptos, which are the dog reads. So we got doge listed on there. We got sheep. And you know they're probably going to start listing other ones. They're probably going to start listing like baby doge. Uh, Floki has been one people have been pushing. I don't think, I don't know if Floki will get on there or not. But Baby Doge, I definitely believe Baby Doge has the possibility to get on there. We just need to continue to push Baby Doge to the masses. So that's one thing that's also good with Baby Doge today. We got a lot of good stuff for today. The next thing that we want to talk about here is the low volume. So right now we do have pretty low volume. You can see over here only $7.3 million in the last 24 hours. That's not too bad, but it's not really real what we want to see here. Only 7.77 trillion coins burned. But over here, we only have about a thousand new holders today, which is also not too bad because, you know, any new holder is a good new holder. So a thousand new holders is still pretty good for us, still fairly well. Now, anyways, moving on from here, you can see the volume that we have with Baby Doge, still pretty small. But what we really want to do is go over the technicals. So we're going to go over that in a second. So 1.5 million holders, we all know that. Baby Doge has been on a little bit of uptrend today, trying to get back some of those gains that we lost over the week. Now, going over this next thing for Baby Doge, let's go over these technicals. So first thing I want to talk about with the technicals here, the 24-hour market control is in control by the bears by 60%. This is pretty much showing Baby Doge is 60% bear, bu bullish, I mean, not bearish, but yeah, 60% bullish. So it has been trying to get above this Fibonacci retracement. It has been trying to get above this resistance. So let's just go ahead and get in on this 15-minute chart so you can see what I'm talking about here. Literally, Baby Doge is stuck here. It's trying to get above it. We got above it very briefly right here, but we got rejected right back down into it. And now we're trying to get back up above it again. It looks like we may be getting rejected again here. So we may see another pullback for Baby Doge. So I just want you to be aware of that because... 
a lot of people think that this could be the bottom. But honestly, I don't believe that it could be. Maybe Baby Doe continues to go down because we, we're just literally following the pattern. So the red areas pretty much show support. Or, well, now the red areas are resistance. It was support way up here. But yeah, these red areas pretty much showing our resistance, what we're trying to pass. So it shows less demand. Now, whenever we have green areas, it pretty much shows more demand. The fact that we don't see any green areas here shows that right now, Baby Doge just has not much demand around this point, which pretty much is because, you know, the whole overall crypto market. There's not much demand in the overall crypto market. Right now, the crypto market has been down. Things have been trying to recover. But Hopefully this isn't another bull trap. People have been talking about how this could be a bull trap if we start to run up again. But anyways, moving on from there, I want to keep doing some more technicals here with Baby Doge. So the next thing that we want to look over here is with the four hour chart. So looking at the four hour chart here, I know you see that huge red candlestick going down on the downside. Now, if Baby Doge were to go bullish right now, we would have a little bit of trouble trying to get above 2.5 because remember, we do have some resistance here. But once we get there, it's all game all the way up to about 2829. And then from there, we have more resistance for Baby Doge up here at 33. So those are the levels that we need to get past right now. And honestly, if we keep having good stuff like this, what happened with Minus today, making a whole article about Baby Doge, then we can definitely pass these levels. But I just want to see more and more coming from Binance. I want to see them actually list Baby Doge instead of just teasing Baby Doge. I want to see Robinhood actually list Baby Doge instead of just teasing it. Because, you know, they teased they teased sheep a while for they actually listed sheep robin hood and and finance they both teased the whole sheep army before actually listing sheep so the thing same thing could be going on again they could just be teasing the baby doge army before they actually decide to list baby doge hopefully they do decide to list it very soon but right now in the meantime we're just gonna have this selling pressure here for baby doge so just prepare to buy the dips as they come in and that's pretty much all you can do. But, you know, this is pretty much all I got for y'all today. I just wanted to go over this and mention the teasing that Binance has been doing on Baby Dotes. So definitely hit the like button and subscribe. It really does help the YouTube channel out immensely for the YouTube algorithm. Leave a comment in the comment section and let me know what you all want me to go over next. And also, if you want these automated trading indicators, definitely check out the Vital Algo link in the description and use the discount code MARCELLUS for 25% off. And if you want 10% off all your trading fees, definitely check out the MEXC Global link in the description. And as always, I'll be back with another video. Peace.